Welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Foxy New. Welcome back, fight fans. Welcome back. Let's just dig right into it. This is proof Deontay Wilder is ducking Anthony Joshua yet again. And let's just break it down. Anthony Joshua, you know, coming off his victory with Andy Ruiz Jr., came out and stated, you know, I want to become undisputed heavyweight champion of the world. And referencing Deontay Wilder, that's a fight that he wants to get made. He, you know, he collected all these belts. He's not going to give them up and vacate any belts. He's going to fight as mandatory, and he wants to unify with Deontay Wilder. After that statement, Deontay Wilder has since come out and stated, I don't think we'll ever see a unification bout. We'll never see it. And I don't want people to get their hopes up on it because it'll never happen. And this is Deontay Wilder's, you know, him referencing a fight with Anthony Joshua and the fact that he's saying that he don't believe that it will never happen and um, don't get your hopes up we'll never see it it's clear and utter sign that this is ducking yet again from Deontay Wilder need I remind you Deontay Wilder's history with Anthony Joshua this is the same Deontay Wilder that demanded 50 50 split with Anthony Joshua or the fight wouldn't be able to get done. Deontay Wilder is nowhere near the level of Anthony Joshua financially, commercially, and he only has one belt while Anthony Joshua has every other belt in the division, and yet he still somehow believes he deserves a 50-50 split. He clearly was pricing himself out so he didn't have to fight Anthony Joshua. And then you see again, uh, Deontay Wilder was offered over a hundred million dollar deal by the zone to face Anthony Joshua and what did Deontay Wilder do he turned it down his reasoning and logic behind that is because he didn't know what Anthony Joshua was making that's insane and since he turned down that deal Deontay Wilder has been making less and less every single fight and then you turn around and you see Deontay Wilder stating that you know Anthony Joshua's team are begging him for a fight he stated that Anthony Joshua and his team are begging him for a fight. Now explain to me how Anthony Joshua is avoiding you, ducking you, and not wanting to fight you when they're literally begging to fight you. It doesn't make sense. Deontay Wilder is a, a walking, living contradiction when it comes to Anthony Joshua. Anthony Joshua clearly wants to fight, and Deontay Wilder has zero interest in it. And this brings you back to when Deontay Wilder had another chance to unify the entire division to, to, in an attempt to become undisputed when he could have fought Vladimir Klitschko. And Deontay Wilder came out and stated, you know, it's not a matter of when, not if. And so basically saying that he's going to fight Vladimir Klitschko at some point. Um, and yet we saw that that never came to fruition. We saw that that never, ever actually happened. We saw that Deontay Wilder never made the fight with Vladimir Klitschko. And similar to the Klitschko fight, you see that he's not interested in making the AJ fight. He truly doesn't want to be great. He truly does not want to fight Anthony Joshua. It's too much of a dangerous fight because Anthony Joshua can box and punch. He can present Deontay Wilder with a youthful fighter, one that's strong enough to knock him out early and one that's good enough to take him the distance. Deontay Wilder is simply not interested in a fight of that magnitude but once again unbiased as always is the IBFP